Hi guys, welcome back to Tech Trick Tutorial. Today we're going to talk about how to create animated cartoon video using AI. AI video generator tools. It's a step-by-step -step guide to follow easily. So don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Let's dive right in. Now in today's video, we will be showing you different types of AI that will work together to help us build an animated cartoon and we will use Canva to put them all together. So there are three AIs that we will be using. The first AI is called Adobe Express. Make animation for YouTube for free. So you're simply going to search literally what it says in Google. Adobe Express that say make animation for YouTube for free. And then you will be redirected to this page. You will be able to click on create now over here, which will redirect us to another page. Now this application or this website is the one that would allow us to create animations for our video and we have 11 labs over here if you don't know 11 labs is a platform that allows you to create voices of ai and this will be the voice of our animation or our cartoon and lastly we have ChatGPT, of course the classic ai and we will use ChatGPT to produce us a very simple script that our character in Adobe Express will mention. So before we start with that, let's first explore Adobe Express. As you can see here, I already have a character. But as you can notice over here on the right side, I'm, I'm going to turn it to all. There are a lot of different cartoon characters that you could use and play around with. There's all kinds of theme. There's robots. There's humans. There are objects. Depending on the type of cartoon you're trying to create, you will be able to create amazing outputs. So for example, let me look for a very simple one. Let's go with a unicorn, this one over here. So simply select that. And as you can see here, the unicorn will appear over here on the left side. Now assuming this box over here is your screen. Now you could simply position the unicorn wherever you would like it to be. You could resize the unicorn and you could change the placement of the unicorn. We can also change the background if you want. There's a lot of different backgrounds over here. As you can see, for example, the fall park, it will automatically change just like that. But I prefer to use green screen or the, the green background because I would remove the background over here in Canva later on because I would like to use the background that I can create in Canva instead of the ones that are found here. Although the ones that are found here are really great, they're really great for the types of animation that this platform produces, but I just like the freedom that I could build with Canva. You can also change the size over here on the size. You have resize for YouTube, Instagram, and all of this platform over here. Of course, this depends on the platform that you would like to upload your cartoon animation to. For example, you're trying to create a YouTube channel filled with animation. So you're going to, of course, go to resize for YouTube, and go to landscape or have a short. But we're going to go with the landscape for today. Then let's put it in the center. Just like that. Then after that, this is our character for now. What we're going to do next is we're going to go to Canva. Under Canva, you're simply going to click on videos. And you're going to click on the first one video over here. Now this is the default size. This is typically the size of YouTube videos as well. So in this platform, we will be creating our background. So since our character is a unicorn, let's search for a magical environment. Something like that. And let's click on graphics. And there's a lot of different elements over here that you could put together. So let's change our search bar over here. Background, there we go. And there's a lot of different options over here. Uh, let's change it again. It's going to take a while for us to find the specific element that we want. Let's say rainbow, mountain. Uh, see all. It's a bit hard. Now, you don't really need to follow what I'm doing over here on this part. You could use the background of the Adobe. This is just my personal preference. But if you guys don't want to deal with this, creation you could utilize the one in of course adobe express but i'm using this one for now uh position back there we go there's a lot of other elements to be here 
what else could we add that could help with our output uh, search our magical environment again click on graphics you could use the background or actual backgrounds as well if you guys want click position this to the back there we go and there's also this a uh, very nice background over here you could enlarge in this position it to the back as well so that we have that background and aside from that, I think we could settle with this for now. It's not the best, but it, it will do. So this is our magical place for now. So in Adobe Express, uh, let's express or let's position our character. Let's make this person smaller for now and put it on the right side. There we go. Then after that, we're going to go to 11 labs. What you're going to do is you're going to select over here, the center. In this part, this is where you will be able to select the type of voice that you will use for your animation. Now, the best one over here is the voice called Gigi because it has a childish and animation type of voice. It is what it sounds like. Happiness can exist only in acceptance. And see, that's a very nice voice and very fitting for a cartoon animation. So, we're going to be using that voice. Also, under voice setting, make sure that the stability is 30% and the clarity is 60%. So anyway, let's go over here on JotGPT. Let's say create a simple script of a unicorn character introducing itself. Then click on enter. You could build an entire story using JotGPT. I'm just going to minimize so that our time won't be too long. So over here, as you can see, greetings, kindred spirits of a genetic realm. Also, we're simply going to copy this first part, go to 11 labs, paste over here, click on generate, and let's wait for it to generate. And we will be able to play it over here below. And we will also be able to download. Greetings, kindred spirits of the enchanted realm. I am Stardust, the unicorn of dreams and wonders. In the soft glow of the moonlight and the gentle whispers of the wind, I prance through meadows of imagination and weave dreams into reality. See, it's a really good voiceover of an animation. So simply download it by clicking on the download button over here. Go back to Adobe Express. You could record it or you could browse. So let's click on browse. Select the file that you have. And it will upload it. As you can see, it's going to upload. So you're simply going to wait for the animation to sync together with a voice. It's going to do mouth movements as well. You're going to see it in a bit. But right now, we're simply going to wait in the queue and wait for our animation or our audio to finish processing. And as you can see, it's currently importing our background. We have a very simple background in Adobe or Canva over here. What we're going to do is that if we have an image, for example, photos over here, I could simply uh, drag the photo. Assuming this is our animated over here, I could click on edit photo. And I will be able to remove the background to do that process. But the video process is going to be different. So I'm going to show you that in a bit. So we're simply going to wait for this one for the meantime. And there we go. As you can see, we will now be able to download our video. Let's actually play it so that you could see how it works. Greetings, kindred spirits of the enchanted realm. I am Stardust, the unicorn of dreams and wonders. In the As you can see, it's even moving, creating some eye movement and even lip sync. So let's download it, go to our Canva over here, drag it on our screen. Greetings, kindred spirits of the... Uh, let's pause this for now, we go edit video, then simply remove the background under the tools over here. So simply select this and after you will be able to remove the background, you will be able to have the character only as a part of our video. So let's simply wait for it to upload. There we go. Then we will be able to remove the background. And there we go. As you can see, the background has now been removed. Then we can simply position our character over here, for example, there. Then we can simply export it. But let's play it as you can see. Greetings, kindred spirits of the enchanted realm. I am Stardust, the unicorn of dreams and wonders. In the soft glow of the moonlight and the gentle whispers of the wind, I prance through meadows of imagination and weave dreams into reality. And there we go. We have created a very simple animation using AI. So that's how you will be able to do it, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, consider leaving a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.